Okay. I haven't even fucking started. Tyler, let's get fucking serious. Mm. Inbox zero. Seth, I'm gonna record every intro to Gary V365. Let's fucking go. Colin, 11 articles right now. Let's go. I will answer every fucking question you ask. Me and Gary V up in the office. Do rap flapping, walking through corporate. Talks about ownership and leverage. 1800 checks and shout out the beverage. I rant about the too many people in a meeting. I sent like 54 emails to the whole company and, uh, and uh, it was great. This huge communication thing about speed and efficiency. Was only realizing the sink was broken. What was wrong was the well. It's not that there's too many people in the meetings, it's that there's too many people. Sure. I've gotta really fix this and smartly. I've gotta like fix the plane while I'm flying it. The reason I don't tell people to leave good reviews on Glassdoor, like on things of that nature, is I don't wanna force anything. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But if you believe what you're telling me here, and especially if you get to know me a little bit better, I need offense on the floor, because negat- just like in society, negativity's on offense, positivity's on defense. Yeah. We're in here? Hey. Hi, how are you? How are you? Good, thank All good? you. It is our belief that your social video production team, in my opinion, is two people. Somebody who's the, a predator who can shoot and edit, a predator who can shoot and edit, and she and he, he and he, she and she, can decide, like, divide and conquer, work together, but both, I'm sick. (laughs) Good, I can both, you know, both do both. The end, two. Good man, can you play some music or something? It's freaking me out. (laughs) Hey, Emma. Hey. How are you? Really? That's devastating. Show his hat. Perfect. Thank you. Alexa, say Gary Vaynerchuk. Cool. I couldn't find a contact matching Gary Vaynerchuk. I just wanted to see if it said Vaynerchuk instead of. Watch this. Hey Siri. Call AJ Vaynerchuk. Edge Vaynerchuk. Mobile. <laughs> Siri calls her last name Vaynerchuk. <laughs> Good job, Alexa. Alexa, play I'm Still Standing by Elton John. I'm Still Standing isn't included with Prime but is available with Amazon Music Unlimited. Would you like to learn more? Yes. Amazon Music Unlimited lets you play tens of millions of songs on this device. It's free for 30 days and then you'll be automatically charged $3.99 a month. Cancel anytime. Terms in the Alexa app. Yes. Should I start your free trial and play I'm Still Standing? Yes. How dangerous is that? You now have Amazon Music Unlimited on this device. I'm Still Standing. I wonder whose credit card this is on. (laughs) So in this daily V, even though we won't be pushing it for a couple of weeks, the early people can get access and if they have an Alexa and all they have to say is Alexa download Gary365? Add Gary V365. Yeah. Alexa, add Gary, Alexa, add Gary V365 to my flash briefing. Oh, I can do a really cool thing. Instagram, you guys are getting a scoop. Gary V365, add it to your flash briefings. Hit me up if you did. Especially on Twitter, then I'll actually see it. <laughs> DMs are busy. So be, that would be awesome to get audio intros each one. Start figuring out the, what it looks like for a workflow to get a video version of this. Whether we're actually cutting. Well, the video versions. versions we should use the the search engine because it'll be so fucking easy. Yeah. Like we should just keyword stuff, find that exact moment, and use Ask Gary V. Exactly. Cool. The the audio and the video version have to be the same, though, right? It has to be the mm-hmm. same file because it plays. Like essentially, you'll be hearing the audio from the video. Yeah. We need to look at that. I think that's what, yeah. Thank you, guys.
Hey guys, uh, I guess most of this episode will probably be tonight's jam session, but um, while I've got you here, huge arbitrage. Holiday weeks are the best. I've literally met with some of the most senior people that I'm trying to do and doing business with today, and it's such an insight, right? Like, like, and then by the way, I think people should, because I, people always get so mistaken by what I'm saying. I love and think many people should take the rest of this week off and maximize family time, vacation time, reset time. However, it's intriguing that there's such an opportunity to meet and have the meetings I had today in a three day week where a lot of people took off. So if you're gonna work during and around Labor Day, 4th of July, Memorial Day, Thanksgiving, Christmas, uh, New Year's, keep in mind some of the most difficult people to get a hold of are most available during this time of year. So that's your little tidbit. I wanna give you more actionable advice. When you dream up of having a meeting with 10 people that are impossible to get a hold of, right? It's the holiday weeks, ironically, that are sneaky. 99 out of 100 times, they are also away with their family. She's away with her, her family, he's away with his family, but it's the one in 100, and I think the, I think the, the one in 100 is better than the one in 1,000 that you get in all the other 44 normal weeks of the year. Yeah, stuff is getting canceled. Yeah, people, like this is the time to get somebody. Like, cause, because, you know, if you're working, like I am, these three days, you wanna do things. You don't want to just like sit around, and uh, and uh, you're right. People get you know even though other people wanted to do it today, maybe they decided to extend their, maybe they got drunk on the Fourth of July and were like, oh, I'm not going to work actually anymore. You know, it's a, that's an interesting insight that I bet I bet you that's one of those classics. I didn't think about that kind of thing. I guarantee four people watching Daily V will get a meeting in the next year around a holiday week because of that tidbit. This is really why I do the vlog. This little thing right now. Well, I don't think you're thinking of that shit, Justin. Uh, what do you mean? I didn't even think of that. <laughs> even I didn't think of that. <laughs> even you, the genius of the world. Yes, D-Rock. You did. What do you, you feel, sad big... that you're not in this vlog? You want to be in it today? Should... Wanna, uh, interrupt you want to show everybody your awesome tan? I didn't get it off. Tan yeah. plus. You look great. What's up? Um, you want to write an article? Colin. Yes, I would definitely see Colin tonight. Colin. Well, hold on, I mean, you're, when did he get your job? Did, does, did Tyler approve? <laughs> I'm not sure. Get out of here. Uh, Tyler, uh, Tyler's the boss around here. I'm gonna say yes to everything, yep? Uh, Can we do it tonight? Yeah. Tonight. Well, what's next? When's she here? She's tonight. on her way upstairs right Okay, now. go ahead. Yeah. Um, you did what, didn't you do Colin! August? What? You did August last summer, right? You read in the video about August? Oh, did I? Yeah, you're right. Similar theme. Yeah. Uh, Colin! 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 You know him and Elliot moved in together? <laughs> Colin and Elliot moved in together? Colin. 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 Don't get cozy. We're not, we're, just have one thing to say. Never trust E-Rock. Cool, close the door. Do not silly Snapchat. Drop a step. No, it's okay, not. So why not? Be- like, because they can drop a feature tomorrow that changes. Which they did today, actually. Correct. Yeah, All of a sudden, <laughs> you can actually do what Instagram Stories does, and if you have audience there, plus everybody under 25, or more specifically under 21, still favors it. And if I go right now to the App Store, which I, ha- I didn't do this morning, which is unusual, but. If I go right now, and I'm just gonna look at the top of the charts, and here they are, Snapchat is number four. It's not like it's number 54. Yeah. It's not dying. Like this thought of deleting a platform that hundreds of millions of people use that could start different features in the same way that Instagram didn't have those features and everybody was going to Snapchat. Yeah. Why couldn't Snapchat? create something tomorrow that changes the outcome. It, it makes zero sense in a world where your job and your life is predicated on you arbitraging attention and awareness to the things you do to close a channel that isn't charging you because it seems similar to another channel would be the same thing as saying you're not gonna air it on CNBC and Fox Business because they're both, 
CNBC and Fox Business or MSNBC and CNN. If MSNBC and CNN both wanted you to do a five minute spot and talk about the same exact thing, intuitively I feel like you would do them both. The only thing that matters is attention. That's what you're trading on. The only thing that matters is other people's attention because without it, it doesn't matter what you're creating. Right? Yeah. That's why you don't delete Snapchat. That's why you get good at things. That's why, Alexa, play my daily briefs. Here's your flash briefing. From Gary V365. Am I watching the patterns of 14 year old teenagers who- That exists, Alexa stop. That exists because I know that's the next landscape of attention. And so I already know that voice is the next social media and that's why I have a top 100 podcast and that's why I have an Alexa flash already. Perfect. Awesome. Thank you, cool. thank you You're so welcome much. so much. Thank you so much for your time, man. Yeah. Really appreciate Continued it. Continued success, guys. How you been? Good, man, how about you? Real well. Yeah. Life good. is good. Yeah, man, just uh... Good to see you again. See you, you enjoyed it last time? Mm-hmm. Oh, I loved Did the it. guys love it? Everybody loved it. Was yeah. everybody like, he's cool? Hell yeah, because you gave a different perspective that we don't get on that every day in just yeah. such a short time. You know? Yeah. It really resonated with people. Good. They felt the authenticity. Yeah, definitely. You know, and you really care. You know, you feel <laughs> yeah. you're saying like this. Yeah. You know? so yeah. Everybody knows that. All right, you're talking yeah. serious stuff. Yeah. You can't be making this stuff up. Yeah, you know? cool. Let's work with Tyler and get together this summer before it's over okay. with you and your crew. Mm-hmm. And I'll break it down for you guys. All right, sounds perfect. Good, my man. Thank you, man. Yeah, my man. Appreciate it. Continued success, man. Get healthy. All right, thank and I'll you, see you soon. All right, Ty, well, he's got a crew I got to meet with. I know summer's tight. Either somewhere in the end of summer if I'm coming in for one day I've been thinking about or right as we get back after Labor Day. Right? Like, let's build up our Instagram so people are swiping up and you're getting, I mean, I'm getting insane. Like, in, my Instagram URL link and my Instagram story swipe ups are driving more of the things that I want to happen than, like, it's, what? Then like email and like fucking Facebook, which were like my drivers. It changes real fucking fast. Alexa, play I'm Still Standing by Elton John. I mean, the world can change really quick. I'm Still Standing by Elton John. Shut up, Alexa. <laughs> by the way, this Alexa thing has added enormous amounts of quality yes, to my ability to have meetings. meetings. I was literally just like, I'm just gonna do this for fun. And like confused. <laughs> the- <laughs> I posted this. I took this photo no, like, in my backyard. No. Just like. What was the point of that? Just, just to copy. confuse the fuck out of everybody. It worked. What was your copy? I'm gonna destroy, destroy today. <laughs> destroy is a slang term for leaving all my efforts on the field today. Field is a slang term for my work. <laughs> Alexa, who's Rick Ross? Yeah. Rick Ross, Indy <laughs> Southern slash Christian soft rock artist. What are we doing? That's it. Ooh. <laughs> 9.30, we're asking we're Alexa what Rick Ross is. We've probably had the single most productive meeting I in agree. the history of our business relationship and you're complaining. Okay. I haven't even fucking started. Tyler, let's get fucking serious. Inbox zero. Seth, I'm gonna record every intro to Gary V365. Let's fucking go. Colin, 11 articles right now. Let's go. I will answer every fucking question you ask. Alexa, who's Ryan Harwood? <laughs> Kobe Bryant and I are gonna be best friends. It's the most foregone conclusion. I'm, I just want everybody to know this. This is firm. Just remember I said it. Kobe Bryant and I will be best friends within the next five years. Best friends. Not just business acquaintances, homies. Alexa, who's Kobe Bryant? Kobe Bean Bryant is an American retired professional basketball player and businessman. Businessman, wow. Businessman. Wow. Businessman. You hear that last thing? Thought leader. You hear that? He's a businessman? Yeah. You know who's a better businessman? Me. <laughs> I've got the competitive edge now. Kobe. Dan selling candy to kids in school. Life is good? How's it been going? It's going well. Just learning a lot, plugging away on the YouTube channel for Sid, doing community insights in the morning. Gathering things, comment of the day, whatnot. But watching your content, I see how far ahead you are, and I say I'm gonna get started. Yeah, I respect that. Right. But I think you know it's it's macro, patience, micro speed. It's hard to think like that. Though. It's very hard, but that's why good things happen to me, right? Like that's you know like everything that's good is hard. That's true. 
You know what I mean? Like, no. like nothing, nobody's winning. You're not winning cause. You're winning cause you did something nobody else is willing to do. Good day, good day, 10 p.m. Holiday weekend, look at, look at the team. Yeah. Anybody want to get destroyed real quick? Oh no, Gary. Oh, good job, Gary. He doesn't suck, he's pretty good actually. Just, I'm the greatest of all time. Ooh, Just, you know how lucky you were there? You saw what I did there, Ars? Justin's learning some of my moves. Justin, where are you going? Seven to one was close. Justin, where are you going? Seven to one was good. That was a good try by you. Seven to one's not bad, bro. He's gotta walk that one off. No, that was devastating for him. <laughs> he walked into a buzzsaw. You walked right into a buzz. He walked into a buzzsaw. It's my favorite line. It is, right? You know what it is? You know what hurts him the most? is he's been trying and prepping and practicing. I've been, I've been working and hustling and doing my thing. I just nonchalantly walk in here and dismantle him seven to one. Colin, you know what's sad? It was over before it started. It was three nothing before Justin even got settled in. D-Rock. Is D-Rock any good? D Rock, get back here. Six to one. You only had four shots on goal. I mean, seven to one, right? You had two less shots on goal than I had goals, Tyler. I feel amazing. <laughs> you know, it's really interesting, right? Like, when you're just better than other human beings and everything, it just feels really good. Proud of myself. Nobody who watches my vlog can beat me in bubble hockey. Nobody. Nobody. <laughs> See ya. Thank you.